Hey guys, this is Ryan from Affiliate Marketing with Ryan.com. I have another video for you guys this morning. It is Monday morning, and uh, this video is about Google Hours Website Optimizer. Just started using it about a month ago, and it's a great tool. I wish I'd started using it a year ago because the data it gives you is uh, pretty amazing, and it just takes your campaign and makes it that much better. Um, so in a nutshell, Website Optimizer is used for seeing which page layout or which combination of headlines, call to action, etc. give you the best conversion rate. Um, for an affiliate marketer, since we don't, since it's not the, since the products that we're promoting aren't ours and we don't have access to the thank you page, you would use Website Optimizer to test the conversion of your click-through rate. So you're using a landing page and the click-through rate would be the people that go to your landing page and then click through to the merchant site on your affiliate link, of course. Um, if you're using pay-per-click I'm assuming you're using landing pages if you're not you should be and you want to test to see how many people come to your landing page and then click through to the merchants uh, merchants page using your affiliate link so website optimizer helps you increase that click-through rate that conversion rate um, there's two two ways you can use website optimizer there's an AB, AB split testing and then there's multivariate testing AB is where you take page one and you compare it against page two. Uh, website Optimizer lets you do multiple pages. You can have like five different pages. You create five pages, and then you upload those five pages into Website Optimizer, and Google will tell you which page, one, two, three, four, five, had the higher conversion, or in your case, the click-through rate. Uh, there's also the multivariate testing. That's where you have like two or three different headlines, two or three different call to actions, two or three different uh, images, etc. That's obviously the most powerful um, way to use Website Optimizer, but you need a lot, a lot of conversions in order to get meaningful data. Otherwise, it's going to take you forever. Um, I think Google AdWords says that if you have less than 1,000 conversions a week, you should go with um, A-B split testing, and if you have more than 1,000, then you should use multivariate. I think that's correct. Uh, below this video is a page with an overview on how to use Website Optimizer and it goes into more detail. So the way an affiliate marketer, the way you would use Website Optimizer to test the click-through rate is you know, determine, depend, um, determine which one you want to use, the A, B, split testing or the multivariate. And then since we don't have access to the thank you page, of course, of the product you're promoting, you would put the conversion code on your affiliate URL redirect so you don't use your your affiliate links on your landing page wouldn't be bare they'd be masked with a redirect like a, PG, a PHP redirect or a um, like an HTML redirect and on that P PHP or HTML redirect you would put the conversion data so when the person goes to your landing page and they click on your affiliate link that gets tracked as a conversion in website optimizer and then after two three days couple weeks or whatever you look, uh, you look at the stats and Google will tell you, all right, page one definitely has the higher click-through rate or page two definitely does or this combination of headline and call to action has the higher conversion rate. And then you obviously you run, you run that page or you start another test and see if you can get the conversion rate even higher. So it's very cool, very powerful. I've been using it for about a month and on my top, uh, my top converting campaign, I just did a simple A-B split test, page one versus page two, and the new page that I created had a 50% higher click-through rate than the one I had been using for the longest time. So, you know, that shows you how powerful it can be. So now I'm running more tests to see if I can increase that conversion rate, but 50% is pretty, pretty cool. Um, I think that's it. Yep, that's it. So uh, look below this video. There is a link to Google AdWords. Uh, section of website op website optimizer gives you a lot more details of how to run the uh, run the test and I uh, hope it works out for you guys. If you have any questions, just leave a comment and I will get back to you as soon as possible. All right, thanks. Hey guys, it's Ryan again. I uh, once I pressed the stop button, I went to go look at website optimizer and I realized that one of the things I said was incorrect. Uh, you would use A/B split testing. They recommend you use A/B split testing if you're if the landing page you're testing in Website Optimizer receives 1,000 or less views or clicks per week. 
and they recommend using multivariate if your landing page receives more than 1,000 views or clicks per week. So it's not conversions, it's actually clicks. Okay, thanks.